Halloween, a season of frights. From creepy costumes to spooky stories. <laughs> and there's one ghostly tale involving a Ouija board that happened right here in St. Louis. And it was such a phenomenon that it got national attention on the popular TV show, Unsolved Mysteries. Beginning in 1913 and continuing for several years, the lively spirit of a 17th century English woman named Patience Worth reportedly spoke through the board from beyond the grave. And by all accounts, Patience wasn't content with a simple hello. She composed plays, novels, and countless poems. There was a woman by the name of Pearl Curran. She is basically your average middle class, St. Louis housewife. Pearl decides to take her turn at the board and a, a person comes through, a voice comes through, however, however you want to describe it, a message comes through, and it's a, a woman who states her name as Patience, Patience Worth. Day after day, Pearl continues to channel Patience through the Ouija board, transcribing messages from her one letter at a time. To the extent that sometimes she was putting out 5,000 words a night, which is pretty amazing. Christopher Allen Gordon, director of library and collections at the Missouri Historical Society, says they have 37 volumes of transcriptions that Pearl and Patience created. They're typed out transcriptions. We also have a collection of Patience Worth's novels and some of her poetry and a few uh, issues of the Patience Worth magazine. Through Pearl, Patience Worth dictated books, plays, and poems. The story overall is, is pretty incredible because you have to realize it's not just about the story of this person who claims to be channeling these messages through a Ouija board. Pearl Curran was authoring stories and poetry through this channel. Pearl's paranormal experience garnered her a large following. Probably the most extraordinary thing was that uh, she dictated an entire novel and the novel which is the sorry tale was released to acclaim uh, so much so that it was reviewed by the new york times together pearl and patience authored six novels two poetry collections several plays and volumes of witty banter People were astounded at the story. It is, it's, it is an incredible story. Some critics claimed it was a hoax and Patience was just from thoughts that Pearl was thinking and not an actual spirit being channeled. Obviously, people are questioning whether this is authentic or not. She had quite a few critics. So whether this is a tale of truth or just a bunch of hocus pocus. I put a spell on you. And now you're mine. We'll never know because only one person knows the truth and she's not talking yet. And her headstone says Pearl Curran and underneath in it does say Patience Worth. Took it to the grave. <laughs>